Wolfish here, guys, welcome back. Uh, gonna be playing Paroxysm. In this game, uh, we're gonna be playing as a, you know, as an influencer slash YouTuber slash whatever, like a paranormal paranormal hunter um, to get those uh, good old sweet views and um, grab some cash. But unfortunately, it seems like we'll be dealing with some real creepy. Uh, Creepy messed up shit. Dark and gloomy city. Like real ghosts and stuff. In the world of internet broadcasting, I'm on the trail of a horror story. I'm someone who boldly ventures into dark and mysterious places to attract views to my channel. But this time, things seem scarier than usual. I heard rumors about scary stuff happening in an apartment building. People had to leave the area because of it. Residents speak of weird noises, shadows, and even ghosts there. As someone who yeah, the standard. Home, this got me interested, so I decided to check it out. Bro, what was that behind you? Yeah, it's always such a good idea, right? Like... Okay. And how did you get permission to get there? Is it like some kind of an abandoned... Abandoned place, or... Go to the apartment at the end of the street and enter flat number 10. Okay. Do you really have to film everything all the way through? Okay, apartment 10 it is. Ooh, creepy stuff. Ooh, ghosts, bro. Ghosts. Things already happening. Is this the entrance? No. Oh, of course, it has to be the entrance with the flickering light. I bet it is. Oh wow, it's not. Okay, the end of the street, was it? Okay. Okay. Flat 10. Flat number 10, so it's obviously upstairs. What do we have here? Okay. There's no... There's no numbers on the doors, bro. Flat number 10, I suppose uh, there will be a number uh, once, I s once I get there, right? Surely it's not on the the top floor. Oh, there we go, number 15. I just know it's number 13. Okay, so it's uh, downstairs. Number 10. The numbers are so tiny, bro. Okay, number 10. Okay, I thought... For a second there, I thought we already had the key. Why are we, like, um, waiting for someone to... Okay. We're supposed to be entering it. 
do we have the key or something? Options, uh, controls. Yeah, nothing. Nothing says about. Um, don't have a way to open the inventory. Okay. Huh. Um, am I missing something from upstairs then? There's gotta be, right? Okay. There is a key on the top floor for some reason. Since they to did, they did tell us to go to apartment number 10, I guess this is... I guess... That's my invitation. No electricity, just my luck, bro. If there's no electricity, how am I supposed to see stuff? Jesus, it's so... It's pitch black, bro. Okay. Hello? That's typical Soviet apartment. Place your bag in the living room and take your items. I have a feeling I've played this game before. It looks so much like September the 7th or whatever it was called. Place the motion sensor in front of the main entrance. You really had to do that, bro. Oh no, the EMF reader <laughs> to detect a level 5 anomaly. Oh boy. Okay, do we need to activate it or does it detect stuff automatically? It's nice kitchen Wait, there's bread here. Someone lives here, bro. Isn't this like trespassing? I think I better close the door, bro. Uh-oh, something's beeping. It's a bit tight, the entire... Uh oh. The entire bed occupies the entire room. Huh, a closet without any lights on. Of course, bro. Who was this? Balcony. Okay, the windows are kinda... Either tinted or... Not cleaned. What am I looking for here exactly? EMF reader doesn't like that, bro. Yeah, it's definitely here. Something about this bed, right? Well, okay. Bruh. What? <laughs> was this... Was this here in the first place? Don't think I've noticed this. Uh, the towel was there, yeah, but not the mask, right? Okay. Oh, there's more, a bathroom. Right, okay. Oh, finally can see something outside from outside. Wait. 
that doll wasn't there, bro. What? What happened to the electricity? Oh god. Yeah, TV... What's that? I guess I need to restore the electricity. If I could just find my way back to the corridor. Okay, this is the bathroom, so it should be here somewhere. Oh crap. Bruh. What? Is that the entrance? Oh god, this is the kitchen. This is the bathroom. This is the corridor, okay. Oh, okay, so the electricity only disappeared in the um, uh, apartment. Okay. How do I restore the electricity? Bruh. Was that light? Ooh. All I had to do basically to flip a switch. Wait. Did the mask guy disappear? Why is it pitch black now? Oh no, it's still here. What's up with the creepy music now? Something's definitely happening, bro. Hello? Perform the summoning ritual here. What? What are you talking, bro? A summoning ritual? <laughs> what? Okay. That is such a bright idea, bro. Whatever. What can go wrong, right? Oh boy. Okay. 
Summon and ritual. Do I need like a spell or, or a book or whatever? Yeah, it's a book. Oh, it's not a book, it's candles. Okay, every single step it's like a cutscene. Uh huh. Holy Bible. What? You're gonna use Holy Bible, um, Holy Bible for, for a summoning ritual. <laughs> the light just randomly switched off in the background. It's funny how all of this is for views. I don't think the guy actually believes any of this in any of this stuff. Wow, I got summoned, bro, to another dimension, some kind of creepy medieval church. What the hell? Bro, what is happening? Alright. Am I supposed to be one of these dudes now? I still hear the... I still hear the motion detector in, in, in the background in that apartment. Wow, creepy. Excuse me? <laughs> okay, the, the dude performed the summoning ritual, got summoned to some random whatever church, and he opens the book and it says cursed. Did you really expect something else, bro? It's a pretty obvious outcome, don't you think? Oh, the windows are no longer tinted, wow. Bruh. Whoa! What? What? Is she coming here? No, bro. No way, brah. Brah. What the? Can I hide? Please tell me I can hide. Bruh, she can't open the door, right? Ok, 
Okay. The phone is switched off. How is it work? Okay. What was the point of that? She's here. The motion detector is working. Why is the plate on the floor, bro? Leave the apartment. You don't say, bro. Okay. Good luck with that. What? You can't. You're locked in. What the... Am I in Silent Hill now? No. What the... Jesus, bruh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What did I do? Help. Some help? What the... <laughs> okay. Shall I be... Should I be worried now? I mean, at least I have some bread here. I can I can live here for a while, right? Bro. Tell me something. Should I be worried? Okay, she's gone. I think the coast is clear. How am I supposed to leave the apartment though? Uh, what about the bedroom? Bedroom... Alright, oh, there's two balconies actually, so it wasn't really... It's a bit confusing. Yeah, two balconies. Okay, what do I do now? Lily, li. Granny, where are you? Come again. Does that mean the granny is nearby? Wait, the water wasn't there, was it? Am I supposed to get out now? Send help? Please? Can I actually remove these planks, maybe? With something. Oh, okay. Someone switched on the TV. That's new. Toilet plus call equals key. Okay. Toilet. There's the skull. And there's the key. What's the key for? Yeah, I thought it's gonna be... I knew it's not gonna be that easy, so... Okay, what do we have here? Yay, flashlight! Bruh! What? Who's messing with electricity? I'm not picking up that bro. 
Fine, I'll check. Wait, it... Someone ran the doorbell, it wasn't actually the phone. Hello? Okay, some kids toys. Okay, that's that does sound like a phone. Fine, I'll pick it up again. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's informative. What? There's actually a cross, bro. I really need the cross against the demonic forces. I hope the guy brought a book for ex exorcism as well. Yeah, seems like this time it won't work. Or will it? Yeah, it doesn't work. Ooh, the bathroom is locked. Someone's having a good time. Alrighty then. Yeah, don't mind me, just take your time. Take your time, bro. Uh, the door just opened <laughs> on its own. Go away. Okay, I will. Can you just let me out, please? I see you. Yeah, you don't say. Oh, and I'm locked in. Thank you very much. I wonder whose skull that is. Okay. You locked me in. What am I supposed to do? Alrighty. Woo! Oh my god, are you serious, bro? How many times did I open and close that curtain and this happened just now? Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ, my man. Okay, just let me out now. I've seen enough, okay? Wait a second. Where am I? And the flashlight is not working. Run? Okay. Oh. Okay, fine. <laughs> I'll guess I run. I'll run. Yes, I'm running, bro. I'm running as fast as I can. I'm not looking back, bro. I am not looking back. I am not looking back. What is happening? Okay. Huh.
Thank you for giving me the key, I guess. <laughs> oh, bro. Why? Still in the toilet. Wait, how come that layout is a little bit... A little bit different. Uh, still no, still no electricity. That's unfortunate. I think it's. Yep, I knew it from the cabinet. You're not allowed alone in this house. The woman you're looking for, aren't you? If if you want to find her, listen carefully. Didn't you hear her screams? The echo behind the walls. Her blood still decorates the walls. I place her there with my own hands right before your eyes, where we hide all our secrets. Keep hiding, but remember, every wall has a secret. Okay. <laughs> Bro, can you stop <laughs> doing that, please? I beg you, I beg of you. Okay, the hammer is for those planks, right? So I can... Oh, I can actually enter. So what's... That is a lot of pills. And this doll again. Why is it looking there? Okay. I'm gonna just smash the wall for whatever reason is that oh so that's the dead lady I thought she was a granny uh, if this note falls into someone's hands let them know that they have not freed the woman's spirit instead they have cursed her soul upon themselves now her nightmare will be your reality there is no escape Bro, I'm innocent. I, I'm just, I'm just a YouTuber, okay? I've been trying to get good views, and I decide to do film some paranormal stuff. How, how am I, how am I to blame for this? Why are you blaming me, Bruh, It's not fair. Hello. <laughs> Yay, I can leave, bro. Okay. Something tells me it's not gonna be that easy. Oh, there's the exit. Wow, that's easy, actually. Well... Guess that's my cue. I'm leaving. Come again? Does that mean I'm not leaving? Oh. Oh. Bro, you know what? Something tells me I'm still stuck in that apartment. I never left. It's just an illusion, right? Who the fuck was that, bro? I didn't see, didn't even see anything this time. 
At the end of this dark adventure, I have come to understand what true fear is, the path I took to explore haunted places and capture supernatural events on camera has come at a heavy price. This terrifying woman's house, the horror of the corpse trapped within the walls, all of this is etched into my mind. As I fled the apartment with the key in my hand, I knew the nightmare I felt behind was just the beginning. Did I really escape or will this horror for forever haunt me? This question echoes in the depths of my mind, giving me no peace. I am on the brink of losing my sanity. This is no escape. There is no escape from the darkness. I see only one way out. Perhaps this is the only way to end the terror I have lived through. I, I hope you steer clear. Bro. Bro. Wow. This is like... This is like, I think, like my third game in a row, almost like in a row where the main character is like... Okay, I've seen enough, bye! Even, they, even though they managed to escape. It's a nice short game, not gonna lie, I like the Soviet aesthetics and stuff. Uh, story was like, very simple. The jump scares... Um, I like the way Granny just ran into the apartment building, that was kinda cool. The ending was a bit depressing, but uh, either way, I'll be seeing you guys in the next one.